guys welcome back to my channel if you are new here hi I'm Sharla and you have entered my beauty room and viewers discretion is advised if you do not like pink exit now because <laughs> this whole video is going to be all about pink girly items in today's video I'm going to be sharing some items that I have recently bought this is going to be kind of like a haul and I bought a lot of stuff recently and it's all pink most of it is affordable pretty much all of it is affordable so um, if you guys want to check out some of these items I will link them down in the description box below but basically I bought some stuff from Victoria's Secret, Too Faced um, I bought some items and received some items from small women owned businesses so if you guys want to see what I got then make sure you keep watching. Okay so the first thing I'm going to start with is Victoria's Secret because I want to reel you guys in to all of the cute things that I got that I know you guys are going to be excited for. So I'm going to start off with my items that I got from Victoria's Secret. So first thing that I got that I want to show you guys is this perfume from Victoria's Secret called First Love and this is the um, newest one that they came out with so this is the one that's in the green bottle. If you guys saw my um, perfume boyfriend rates my perfumes um, you would have seen that I had the rollerball and I was really really thinking about getting the full-size one and uh, let me put my phone on silent really quick because I'm getting a ton of messages okay so um, I was really considering getting the large size but um, I didn't know if I should get it or not but the more that I would put the rollerball on more I was like wanting to get it because I would like fall in love with it um, so here is how it looks and I love that you can use the packaging for decor like I haven't thrown away my other one because it just looks so pretty um, sitting anywhere and this is how she looks it is so pretty and oh it smells so good if you guys don't know what this smells like I'm just gonna give you a hint like um, like some of the notes, it has sweet pear and then it has like jasmine and floral. Like it's very florally, but it's very sweet. Like it's not too like florally, um, if you can get what I mean. But um, yeah, if you guys want to check it out on the website, you can like see the notes because I'm not good at describing perfumes. I just really, really love this. It gives like a very clean scent um, and it's not too overbearing. So. Um, I did decide to get that one, so I'm just going to put it over here. And the second perfume I wanted to get was the Tease. This is how she looks. So if you did see my um, perfume video, if you guys haven't seen it, make sure to go watch it. It's pretty fun and you guys get to know my husband, Mark. Um, but this is actually his favorite perfume on me because this is the perfume that I used to wear when we started dating and for some reason I only have the rollerball. I've never bought the perfume. I'd always just get like the body sprays and he said this reminds him of when we were barely going out so this was on sale as well so I was like why not buy the perfume and put it on so he can be happy. <laughs> So this is how the bottle looks. It's very sexy looking. So this is how it looks and let me smell it. Oh, it just smells so good. So I feel like this is the best perfume if you're trying to, um, if you're wanting to go on, if you're going on a date and you want a guy to notice you, you're going to a party, whatever. I know we can't do that right now because we're in quarantine, but I'm just thinking of the future. If you are trying to get a cute guy to notice you, I think this is the perfect perfume to get and start out with because my husband said out of all the perfumes, this one was his favorite. And I do have a few other friends who own this perfume that say their husbands really like it. So I think this is the perfect perfume for that purpose. And I love the packaging. I'm also going to be keeping the box. It just looks so cute. So 
The last perfume from Victoria's Secret I got is this rollerball and I only got this rollerball because if you spend $85 or more they give you a free tote and I'll show you guys the tote here in just a second. So I needed one more small item to um, get to $85 so I just got this rollerball. I don't know how it smells but I love rollerballs because you can easily just throw them in your purse. And I have never tried this one, but I've heard it's pretty good. So this is in the scent um, Bombshell. Have you guys ever tried that one? The Bombshell? That's how it looks in the bottle. It looks really pretty. Hmm. This one kind of reminds me of like a Juicy Couture perfume. If you guys don't know what a Juicy Couture perfume smells like. Um, I think everybody knows what a Juicy Couture perfume smells like, but that's what these this perfume like gives me. I feel like I would wear this if I was going shopping and I wanted people to smell me as I was passing by. <laughs> because this is a very strong scent. Like when you walk by somebody, you can smell their perfume. This is that type of perfume. So it's pretty good. It's not something I would wear every single day, but it definitely does remind me of a Juicy Couture perfume because Juicy Couture perfumes are very bold and out there. So that's what it reminds me of. Um, so the tote bag that came free with it was this tote bag right here. And this is a perfect beach bag, travel bag, overnight bag. It is just so cute. I love how it has pink and white stripes. And right here it just says Victoria's Secret in cursive. And it also has a zipper, so that's a plus. I love when tote bags come with zippers so none of your stuff falls out. Let me open it for you. And then the inside is just um, one big pocket. There's no extra compartments. It's just one big hole, so that's how it looks on the inside. Um, but I really wanted this tote bag just because it looks, it's so cute and I've never seen Victoria's Secret do like that baby pastel pink with white, just like the hot pink. Um, and when I mean hot pink, I mean like this type of hot pink. So I also got this Victoria's Secret makeup bag. It was on sale. A lot of their items were on sale this past week. I don't know if any of you shopped their sale, but this is how the bag looks. And it is so cute. I love the bow tie on top. Tanya actually made me get this bag. I'm sure you guys know who Tanya is. Um, she's the one who made me get this bag because I saw it on her Instagram and I was like, oh my God, that is so cute. And then I saw it was on sale and I was like, oh, I need to get it. Um, so this is how the inside looks. And then it also comes with a mini makeup bag like for your lipsticks um, and such but it's so cute it just says victoria's secret on it so that's how it looks in there and what else did i get from victoria's secret oh i got a lot of stuff so this bag just came in today because um i placed that order and then a few days later i went back and saw that they had some really really cute slippers and i was so mad because i was like why didn't i get those slippers so i had to repurchase uh, make a separate order so I got some cute, well they're not like slippers, they're like slides, you can even wear this like to the grocery store. Um, but yeah, these are kind of like everyday slides, but they come in a really, really pretty satin um, bag. You can store them in just to keep them clean because they are velvet. So I have a feeling I'm going to get these dirty really fast, so I need to show them to y'all before I get them dirty. But this is how they look. So they have all of the rhinestones and then this is just a velvet pink and they're just so pretty and comfy and they're very soft so like I said you can wear these pretty much you can wear them out um, you just have to let yourself know that they're gonna get dirty because they're velvet but um, I thought they were really pretty and I think these were on sale as well if I'm not mistaken but um, I really wanted these so I went ahead and got those and then the last thing that I got was some hand sanitizer spray first of all I did not know that Victoria's Secret had um, hand sanitizer sprays so I was pretty excited because I've been wanting um, 
like just easy just to spray my hands when I get in my car or even to spray my steering wheel because you can imagine all the germs on the steering wheel it's easy just to um, spray your steering wheel but it came in a pack of three and they're very affordable so this is how they look so these do not have any fragrance in them which um, I thought it was gonna have a fragrance but when I got them in it said that they, it was fragrance free but um, I don't mind because like I said I'm just going to use this to spray my hands when I get in my car or to even spray um, my door handle and my um, steering wheel so that's what I was just going to use it for but it came in a set of three and they're miniature size you can also get the full size but this is perfect just to put in your bag um, or stick in your car and then I also got this I can't get it out of the case but I got this um, carrier for the hand sanitizer and it's so cute it's just pink with beige stripes I don't know if it'll focus let me see there it goes so it just has light stripes and it has this little chain so you can hang it on your purse um, but I thought that was so cute I'm probably gonna hang it in my car somewhere and yeah, that's how it looks but that was a lot of things that I got from Victoria's Secret I haven't shopped there in a hot minute so um, definitely splurged <laughs> so that's everything that I got from Victoria's Secret Okay, so the first thing that I got from Too Faced, I literally only went to Too Faced to buy this makeup bag. And it is this baby right here. Look how beautiful it is. And I didn't even know it was going to be this big. I wasn't expecting it to be this big. So when it came in the mail, I was like, oh my god, this is huge. But I'm really, really happy that it's this big because this is the perfect like makeup bag when you travel or when you go over to a friend's house and you want to take all your makeup. Like, I'm pretty sure all your makeup is gonna fit in here. Like, you'll only need this one bag for everything. Um, and I like that the inside, it's plastic. Like, a, not plastic, but it's just that, it's kind of like a plastic material to wear if you throw like lipstick in there or powder and you get it dirty, you can easily clean it with a wipe. So that's what I like about it. But the inside, it just has stripes and it just says Too Faced along the lines. It reminds me of Victoria's Secret style, but this is so cute and it's just like a baby pink makeup bag and it has a little bow tie. Um, but yeah, this was probably the only reason why I went on to Too Faced because I really wanted this makeup bag and I'm going to display it on my shelf here in my beauty room so you guys will see it on my Instagram a lot. And uh, by the way, if you're not following me on Instagram, Go follow me on Instagram because I am super, super close to hitting 50K, you guys. I cannot believe it. And once I hit 50K, I'm going to be doing a huge giveaway. There's going to be three winners and the prizes are going to be amazing. So just letting you know. Okay, so let's go on to the makeup. So I got some makeup because I believe some of this stuff was on sale. Um, so I did get some makeup from Too Faced. So the first thing that I got was this hangover spray in the watermelon scent because the watermelon scent is probably my number one fave out of all of them. And I don't know if I accidentally added two to my cart or if they accidentally threw two into my um, box because I ended up seeing two. So I really hope they didn't charge me for two, but it's okay. Um, so I got two. So this is how they look and it literally just smells like watermelon. So I got these sprays and I ended up getting this primed and poreless powder. So this is how it looks up close. Let me go ahead and take it out. Um, pretty much I just got it for the packaging because the packaging is so cute. Like look how cute this packaging is. It's so pretty, but this is like supposed to be a touch-up powder. So this is how it looks on the inside. It's just a translucent powder. So if you get oily throughout the day, I mean, this is Texas weather that I'm living in. It's 110 degrees. So this will definitely be useful to me whenever I sweat or makeup starts to come off. Um, this will help it stay. So i um, really glad I got this other than using it for decor. But I got that and then... I got this um, 
highlighter from Too Faced as well. This is the Puppy Glow. I've never tried this before, but I've seen a lot of people getting it and the reviews were very, very high. So um, I thought, why not try it? So it just comes in this cute gold puppy shaped packaging and it does come with a mirror. So I really do like that. And this is how the powder looks. So I'm gonna swatch it. So this is how it looks swatched. It's very, very, very glowy. So pretty, so I can't wait to try that on. So I got that, I'll let y'all know how I like it. Um, and then the last two items, these were actually free with purchase. Um, so I got an eye glitter and a lip gloss. So this is the eye glitter. I believe I already have this one. It's called Sweet Spot. I do own these glitters in different colors. I don't think I have this specific one, but these are good eye glitters and they're easy just to glide on and throw them on top of your eyes if you're in a hurry, but you still want to look glamorous. Um, this is how it looks. So pretty. I can't wait to try that on. I should try that on with this look, but. We got a long way to go with this haul. <laughs> so um, the next thing that I got was this lip gloss and this lip gloss I actually already own. I have like a whole collection of these lip glosses just because of the packaging and they're so so pretty just to wear them alone. So I picked up this lip gloss. It's in the shade Pants Off Dance Off. So it's like a white iridescent color. So that is everything that I got from Too Faced. This wouldn't be a video if I didn't show you guys bag. So I did get this bag from um, Amazon and I'll link it down below. It's still available, I just barely checked. Um, I did want this bag in pink but somebody swooped the last pink for me so I was mad. So the next choice was going to be this color. So this is what it is. So this is an inspired bag, if you guys know what this bag looks like, you know, you know. I can't say it because Amazon is like very sensitive about how you talk about bags, so I have to say shop the look. So this is the look of the you know what bag, um, but this is like a jelly bag, so this is very easy to clean. If you get it dirty, you can just wipe it. But this is so pretty. So this is like a turquoise Tiffany blue color. Um, and like I said, they did have like a bubblegum pink one. But I guess there was only one left because um, I only waited a few hours. And then I went back to my cart to check out and it was gone. So I was really upset. But this color is so, so pretty. I don't own anything blue. So um, I'm excited to see if I'm going to keep this or if I'm going to return it. I don't know just because you guys know I'm obsessed with pink. I have to have everything pink. But this bag is super cute and it's very heavy as well. So I'm going to open it and show you guys what it looks like. Um, I believe they had a red one. If you guys like red bags, they have red, orange, um, dark blue, I believe. They had um, other colors as well, but this was the next color that I was like, okay, I want to try this color. Um, but this is what it looks like on the inside. Let me just take out the bubble wrap. That's how it looks on the inside. It's just one big empty hole and um, it comes with the chain straps and this hardware is silver. I don't know if I'm going to keep it just because I'm real picky about my hardware. I like the hardware to be gold. I'm not really a big like silver hardware type girl. Um, but yeah, that is how the bag looks and I just think it is just so stinking cute. It definitely looks like a legit designer bag to me. Um, and the brand is called Accent Rain, if you guys want to search it. Like I said, I'll just link it below so you guys can check it out. But it cost me around $100, which is not bad for a bag like this, considering um, the style and um, the quality. Like I said, it's just like a jelly bag, so it's very hard structured, it's heavy, and it's easy to clean. Um, but I think it is so cute like for pictures and even to take to the beach. I mean, it's perfect for summer um, But yeah, that is the bag and I'm in love with it. So 
shop the look and click the link down below and get yourself a cute bag okay so the next bag is from a girl boss that i know her name is kimmy she is a small business owner like myself um she has her own company called kimmy lex dolls if you guys want to check her out i will link her shop down below but she carries a lot of cute items and everything pink so you guys have to go check her out let me find some scissors because this package legit just came in um this package just came in so it's gonna be a surprise for me to open this with you guys um what i got is a subscription box she makes subscription boxes where she'll shop for you and she'll give you like a ton of cute girly things and it's kind of like a boxy charm into like girly designer inspired items so if you guys are interested in that make sure you check her out by the way i canceled my boxy charm um i don't know about you guys but i was getting tired of the products that i was getting so i just decided to cancel it i have too many i have too much makeup anyways so definitely didn't need any more makeup so i did cancel my boxy charm um just so you guys know <laughs> um so i'm gonna go ahead and open this box really quick this is how it looks it just says kimmy lux dolls girly box so i'm so excited to see what she put in here for me <laughs> Like I said, I, I don't know what's in here. She just shops for you randomly. And she just throws a bunch of cute things. So I'm wondering what she got. And I believe there's um, two or three different sizes. Just depending how many items you want. Um, I believe this was the biggest size. I paid $100 for it. Um, and I think there's a smaller size that costs around $40. i am not too sure. But... Um, this one is the large one. Oh, how cute! Okay, so this is how it looks so far. Oh my god, I'm gonna take a thumbnail really, really quick, guys. Okay, so the first thing that I see, I, I'm thinking this is shoes because they're very long and they're shoes, so I'm thinking it's shoes. Oh my goodness! <laughs> oh my god! You guys, look at these slides! Oh my god! These are so cute! Um, so these are some cute jelly slides that have rhinestone crystals on them. And these are like inspired by like, what is it, the Hermes? um but this is so cute <gasps> and i just got a pedicure so they're gonna look cute on my toes let me open the other one i'm just like making a mess all over my floor if you guys see my floor it's a good thing the camera's up here <laughs> but this is how they look you guys oh my god they're so pretty please don't mind me i have big feet because i'm tall so tall person big feet you know um but this is how they look and they're so 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 pretty <gasps> kimmy knew me she knows me okay i'm gonna try them on really really quick oh my god they're so cute and i love how they have rhinestones around the foot like all around the sandal i think that is so cute <laughs> i feel like cinderella with my glass slippers Ooh, these are cute. I just put one on just to model it to see how it looks. These are super cute. Thank you, Kimmy. Okay, so next thing we got in here is something, something wrapped. Let's see what it is. Let's see, let's see. Okay, here's the next item. I love that she wraps everything. Aww. This is so 
cute, but it came broken. So I'm guessing this is like a little jewelry holder or to even hold your sponge. This is so cute. So it's like a little butterfly, but look, it broke in the corner. Aww. This is so cute too. This would have been perfect for my beauty blender or even to put my rings in here or earrings. It's so cute, but I'm so sad it's broken. I'm gonna end up getting the super glue and I'm gonna glue all the pieces together. Aw, it was so cute though, sad. And she even wrapped it really, really good. So the shipping company needs to get it together. Okay, so I'm gonna put that down so I don't step on the glass and hurt myself. So here is the next item. So this is how the box looks so far. <laughs> and I think I saw something in there that I'm like so excited about. Okay, I'm just gonna go ahead and open this one. <gasps> ah, this is so cute! <laughs> Look, oh my gosh. So, Kimmy, if you guys seen my phone case collection, like 80% of my phone cases are from Kimmy Lux dolls. So she knows I'm obsessed with all her phone cases. So she knew she had to send me one. And look how cute this is, you guys. Oh my goodness. This is so pretty. Okay, so let me take a little paper out. And it even has a keychain to carry it. Wow, and it even has a card holder. You can even slip your cash or ID your cards right here and then your phone here so I have the iPhone 10x max so that is how it looks on the inside and then it just has the magnetic closure and then on the back it even says Chanel on the back <gasps> this is so cute <laughs> thank you Kimmy I freaking love this so much okay okay let's see what's next oh, what's next in here Ooh, this is cute so she put a cute makeup brush in here. This is gonna be perfect like for my under eye setting powder. <clears throat> Cause I always look for those small, small brushes like to get right underneath um, my eye when I set because I tend to crease underneath my eyes. So this is how, ooh, this is gonna be perfect too. Look how pretty that is. That's like a rainbow crystal and then it has the baby pink bristles. Oh yes, I like this. Cute. Okay, so there's that. And she did put her thank you card in here. And what else did she put? Oh, what is this? Is it another phone case? She knows I'm obsessed with phone cases. So she could put like 20 phone cases in here and I'd be happy. <laughs> oh my God. Girl, you're killing me. If you're watching this, Kimmy. You're killing me, girl. I'm like, I, I make such ugly faces when I'm excited. So don't mind me, guys. But look what is in there. <laughs> look how pretty this is. Okay, so I already have, um, like, it's very similar that I bought from her. So I did buy, it's on my phone right now. I bought this one from her, and this is the Barbie patent and, um, phone case. And it looks so, so, so pretty. So she did send me the baby pink one that's kind of like reversed, as you can see. Oh my God, that is so cute, I can't wait. I just love phone cases, I'm just like a phone case hoarder. Okay, so my camera's dying. I have a few more things to show, so I need to pick up the pace. And we will be done with this video. So the next thing she got me, ooh, she got me a lip balm from Victoria's Secret. Cute. I do love lip balms. I have a ton of lip balms. Um, so she got me a lip balm and <gasps> no way. She got me some earrings. <gasps> she got me some Chanel earrings, you guys. Oh my goodness, these are so cute. So this is how they look. Oh my god, they're so pretty! <laughs> okay, so I'm actually wearing some from her right now. I'm gonna zoom it in so you guys can see. I'm actually wearing some from her right now. So these are a little bit different. These are more blingy, but I love Chanel inspired earrings. 
So I'm going to open this up real quick so you guys can see. And then there's one more thing in this box. Look how beautiful those are. Oh my goodness. I'm so excited to wear these. So the ones that I have on right now, I think it has like gold hardware. And this one has all silver. So this is so pretty. And it's just so sparkly. I'm in love. Thank you so much, Kimmy. I'm going to open the last one. She gave me a lot of stuff. So the last one that is in here. Oh my God. No way. Look, this is so cute. Okay, so this holds AirPods. I actually don't own AirPods, but now I'm gonna buy AirPods just to put in here. Oh my God, like I'm legit just gonna go buy $300 airpods just so I could have it in this case <laughs> oh my god this is so stinking cute I'm, I'm still gonna put it on my keychain just so it looks cute to pretend I have airpods I'm gonna put this on my keychain but this is so cute oh my god this matches my um bag oh my god how cute is this that is so cute and then Oh, she put some gum in here too. Thank you, girl, because my mouth is a little dry and I need something, some flavor, some moistness. So she gave me some little pieces of gum in here. So that was everything that came into the box. And I did want to mention that you can customize it as much as you want. When you purchase the box, all you do is send her an email saying like what size shoe you are, what kind of phone you have. Um, if you like Victoria's Secret or Pink more, if you like lingerie, if you don't like lingerie, like it's kind of like she gets an idea of what you would like. So she tries to buy or get, you know, things that she thinks you would like. And I loved everything that was in this box. Like there was not one thing that I hated. So I'm so happy with it. Thank you so much, Kimmy. I freaking loved it. And girl, if, if I lived with you, we'd be broke because I'd be shopping with you every single day. <laughs> so that was it for Kimmy's box. And then I am going to show you guys a few other items that are from some small business owners that I think you guys should go follow and support on Instagram. I'll link their pages down below. Um, but I'm just going to mention some of my favorite um sellers on Instagram so the first one is obviously going to be from my girl Tanya and I will post her um, website down below but she does make these Prada pillows and I have like two of her pillows in my room but this one sits behind me on my chair and I freaking love it it's just so pretty and luxurious and it's so affordable because like the actual pillows cost like 80 bucks and who has 80 bucks to buy a pillow you know what I mean so the next thing I want to show you guys is this Starbucks cup and look how gorgeous it is. My camera is dying and I'm, I hope I get to show you guys these last two items before it dies because I'm going to be really, really sad. So this Starbucks cup is from a seller called Vanity Chic Boutique and I'm going to make her so busy because I know you guys are gonna run over to her shop right now after this video and try and order one of these cups but look how gorgeous this cup is and she did special um, customize it for me because I told her I had want, wanted all the rhinestones on the lid so she did add those because I did request it and of course I offered to pay her more um, because I know this takes a long time just to glue every single rhinestone on the lid so I was happy to pay extra and I just love this cup so much it is so pretty and I think it is easy to stay safe like to keep all the bedazzles on there as long as you just rinse your cup right after you're done with your drink just rinse it and um, don't put it in a washer because um, it won't last that way so that's just what I do as soon as I'm done with my drink I throw it in the sink and just rinse it and then air dry it and that's it so if you guys want a cup make sure you go to the link down below the last thing that I want to show you guys is this beautiful bouquet um, this is from pretty luxury bouquet my friend Tilly makes these beautiful bouquet boxes and I think this is just so so pretty so it has the white flowers and it says number five Chanel Paris on it and it has the beautiful um, pearl bead necklace so I think this is so pretty and this will make 
any spot of your room or just anywhere in your house looks so luxurious and chic so I just love it it's so pretty and I just have it on top of my shelf over here next to my vanity so if you guys want to check her out I'll link her down below but that is everything for this video you guys let me know what your favorite item was from this haul and let me know what you guys want to see next and that is it for this video i'll see you guys next time i love you so so much bye